Okay, so welcome back to Bad Bad Bowling, the league edition. As you can see, the team is September 14th. There's Bobby, there's Joe, there's Scott, there's the main man, Tony. And then they're holding me down, you know what I mean? Because I'm sucking today. So they're going to keep it real. Coach is being photobombed. No, we're not. We good. Superman. Superman's photobombing us. So listen, Joe's going to do the commentary. He said he's going to do better than a 12-year-old tonight. So let's see. All right, here we go. All right, we got Bobby up to bowl. Our second bowler, first friend. That bowl hit in between the 10 and the 15 board. Um, nice spare from Bobby. Good start to the game. All right, we got Clarence, our third bowler up on the approach. Feet, looks like his left foot is Round 25, it's a little light in the pocket, and it's not forgiving, but almost gives it to him. Should be an easy spare. All right, let's see if Big C got this. As we all suspected, no problem. All right, now we got Tony up. He was looking pretty clean in practice. Let's see if he can continue it in the game. Right foot on 20, it's a little outside, ball hits the 5 board on the arrows and comes in a little bit too lightly. No one likes a 10 pin, but if anyone's going to pick it up, it's Tony. That's a little inside, it breaks, won't work. Alright, the anchor bowler for tonight, Scott up, starting way left. That one's too inside, maybe a Brooklyn. Can't quite do it. Alright. We got the three up there with the sleeper behind it. He needs to get on the right side of this with the amount of hook he puts on it. It looks perfect. Here's the recap for the first frame. All right, so we have JoJo coming up in the second frame, working on a strike. He's lined up with his feet on 23. Break point, it looks like the 10. Boom, baby, two in a row. Clarence up with a nine spare in the first, nine spare in the second. Playing the five board, beautiful ball. There it is, that's the one he wants. Tony back up to bowl, missed a 10 pin in the first frame and left a split in the second. Two opens in a row, hoping to stop that cycle and get a strike here. Comes in hard, but not hard enough. Leaves that pesky 10 pin. All right, this is a running back moment for Tony. Throwing a strike ball at the 10 pin. Almost, almost ruins it for him, but it pulls through. Scott up, with a spare in the first, spare in the second. Looking for another spare or a strike. Little outside, comes in a bit too hot, leaving a really nasty, really nasty split when they go. That is a chance. Not enough. Okay, so. Just to give you a recap of the scores, uh, Joe's up in the third. Remember, he's got his feet around 23. He's got a break point about five, and it's a deep break point, too. Ball's turning over really well. So let's go ahead and give him this opportunity to get a four-bagger. Let me get in here and get focused in where we can cover his whole line. Now in the league we're in, it's our team is going head-to-head -head with the other team, but it's man against man, so. Okay, that's a little tighter than I thought it would be. Oh, he got a little lucky. Left only the 10 pin. All right, so JoJo's up. I'm hoping that he picks up this 10 pin. He's got a shot at it, and he's got it. 
see a good ball, Bobby. That uh, looks promising. Hold. Beautiful ball. Clarence picked it up from the start. He was having trouble finding the pocket in the first and second frame, and even a nine spare in both. Now he's got a strike in the third, strike in the fourth, and looks like he's not going to have one with it. I'm having a rough start for this game. I'm really hoping for something to turn it around. That looks good. Carries the 10 this time. Nice ball time. All right. Scott up on the approach. Right foot on 25. Gets a little bit lucky, but it works. Clarence off the ball. Clean game so far. Little inside. Can't quite carry all the time. Yet. Once again, should be an easy cover for him, though. Should be an easy spare from Clarence. You can see he's rocking those SST8 bowling shoes, the Dexters. Uh, he does have a video on those. You can check that out. Nice pickup. Two strikes for Tony, hoping for a third one in the seventh. Still lined up about the same spot. 20 board with the right foot. It's too far inside, not going to carry all 10. Tony said, fuck that four pin. All right, Scotty, too hotty up in the seventh frame with a strike in the fourth strike in the fifth and one in the sixth. Open for four in a row. That looks pretty good. Messenger takes out that 10 pin. Nice ball. All right, so we are entering the eighth. As you can see, JoJo's on two in a row. Okay, it looks pretty good. Got a hook and carries. Look at this dude. Bobby up in the ninth frame, hoping for a good setup for the tempo. Little outside, comes in too late. Knocking the 10 down though. Clarence up, struggling to get the strikes this game, but he's got a, he's got a clean game so far, so we can't complain too much. That looks about right, but comes in a little hot, carries all 10 however. Tony had a rough start to this game, but he has picked it up since the fifth. Fifth frame strike, six frame strike, seven frame nine spare, eighth frame strike, hoping for one more in the ninth. He's just having a rough time with those tens. Scotty Too Hotty, aka the Redneck Engineer, up to bowl, ninth frame. Beautiful ball. All right, so we are. Okay, so we're headed into the 10 frame. As you can see, Joe is on four straight. Pretty decent score. Uh, he's in place for a big game if he can hold on to it. Um, we're currently down 13, 12 pins. All right, let's see what we can do to see if we can't win this game. Here we go. Oh, nice line. Beautiful shot. Let's see if we can get two more out of Joe. All right, so as you guys seen, okay, so as you guys seen, Mr. Jojo with uh, that first strike in the tenth, which is really big. Okay, lining up, he's going for it. Same line. Oh, big hook, left a solid ten. All right, so here's Big Jojo the tire man. Gonna get us a shot, pick up this spear, he'll be at a 257 for the game. Oh, and he's picked it up. He's good. Great game, Joe. That looks good, Bobby. Just doesn't have the oomph or the Newtons to bring it in. Let's see if Bobby can hit that head pin split. Ah, that's not gonna come back. Oh, it might! It does! Nice, nice spear, Bobby. Last ball for Bobby. Bobby's second to two hottie. Nice inside line, carries all 10. Clarence on the approach, 10th frame. Right foot somewhere around the 15, between the 15 and the 20. 
Hits a little bit high. Clarence, the 100% spare shooter. 100%, I told you. Last ball for Big C. A CL10, come on. Breaking point about six or seven. Doesn't carry all time. Tony up. Right foot on the 20 board. It's in between the second and the third arrow, and it's a perfect ball, but I guess just a little bit high. Just a little bit high. No problem. Last ball from Tony, lining up in the exact same spot, but he did hit high last time. He needs to speed it up. Oh, well, that's out more. It seems like with that ball and that speed, there's not a lot of room for error. The redneck engineer up, 10th thing. Looks about right. Comes in a little bit too hard. Might break left, and it does. Here's the recap for the final game. Excuse me for the first game of the night. All right, so I missed his first ball. He just made a ball change to the urethane pitch black. I think he hit high, I'm not sure though. Tony up with a strike in the first frame. Hoping for one more in the second. First game was warm up. He's locked in now, baby. Nice ball. I think everyone should stand back right now because he built this shit himself. Looks promising. Might hit hard. Actually hits light and carries all ten. Two in a row for Scott. All right. So we're in the approaching the third frame. As you see, JoJo on two in a row. Which is good. Let's let the camera focus and settle. Let's get out of the zoom that we're in. Oh, I'm a hot mess. Alright, here we go. Oh, that's a good shot. Beautiful. Alright, guys. We got JoJo coming up in the fourth frame. He's currently on two in a row. So let's go ahead and watch him. He's still right around the 20, the 28, throwing that same line. Oh, Brooklyn, and we're taking it, people. That should be good. Just a little bit inside. That should be good. Nice spare from Bobby. That was the fourth frame. Actually, I'll just do a recap. Clarence starting significantly farther right in the first game, throwing his pitch black. And that was about uh, as textbook of a shot as I could, uh, I could imagine. Nice ball. Tony on the approach, going into the fourth frame with a strike in the first, second, and third. Hoping for one more here in the fourth. He's looking pretty on, so I have high hopes. It's a little bit inside, but it carries all ten. Scotty too hotty up. Strike in the first, second, seven, one in the third. Hoping for a strike in the fourth. That is pulled way left. We do need a cover here. If Scott has any chance at beating his opponent, across from him. But I have faith, as long as he doesn't pull this one. Let's pull a little bit, maybe a Brooklyn? Not quite. Here's another recap at the end of the fourth frame. All right, so I'm starting with the close-up. Scotty and Tony on four in a row. All right, so 
we got Joe coming up in the fifth. Oh, nice line. Oh, buried the shot. All right, so JoJo's up in the sixth. Currently on five in a row. And he has been lights out all night. He should have had the perfect game last game. So let's see if he can work it out. Oh, that looks good. Damn, that was nice. I was a little bit late on the recording there, but I'm glad I still committed to it because that was a nice ball from Bobby. Clarence with a spare in the first, spare in the second, spare in the third, and a strike in the fourth and fifth. Looking for a turkey here in the sixth, and he will get it. Nice ball. Tony with all strikes up until the fifth frame. Going into the sixth. A little bit outside, leaves it, leaves the 10 pin. All right, so I got Tony picking up the 10 pin. He was currently again on five in a row. Oh, and he's got it. Made it look like easy work. All right, so Scotty Tuhati is up in the sixth. He hasn't been doing too well, but he's gonna change it all right here, right now. Okay. Uh-oh, beer frame. Close it with a shirt. That's right. He built that shit himself. All right, Scotty Too Hotty. We about know you, baby. All right, so that's the five pin in case you guys can't see it. Oh, it looks like he's got a shot. He's got a shot. Oh, -ho -ho! Ooh, I'm a little late on this. But I got that seventh window. Yes, I did. All right, so we got JoJo coming up in the eighth frame. He's currently on seven in a row. Let's get a little zoom in action for it. He's on 27. He launches it outside. Break point good. Bam, accurate. That makes the first eight. I'll be up with a turkey in the five, six, seven. Hope for another one in the eighth. Perfect ball. That's four in a row. Clarence with four in a row, going into the eight. That pitch black should hit hard, and it does. Tony had a great start to this game. Uh, st all strikes up to the fifth frame. Spare in the sixth frame, and he had a quarter in the eighth. So, get back on that strike turn right now. Nice ball. Scott up to bowl. A strike here will give us a star frame. And it's perfect. Star frame for the bad, bad bowlers. All right, so as you can see, JoJo's on the first eight. All right, JoJo being on the first eight. We're going to zoom this in. Let's take a look at number nine. Oh, it's good. It's good. Oh. Okay, so JoJo's in a tenth. He's got this spare he needs to pick up. He's currently at 237 because he opened in the ninth. Oh, he's got it, people. All right, so JoJo's currently on a spare. So he's at 257 with the next ball scratch. All right, let's see what he has. All right, so here goes JoJo. Looking good. And still can't carry that. A little bit inside, will not hold. Clarence up, he's moved a little bit left since he switched to the pitch black, so the lanes are washing a little bit. I can attest to that. That one's way outside, but that urethane, it's not coming back. Unless Clarence is in his head here, this should be a no problem spare. That looks good, and it is. Let's see, two in a row in the 10. A little bit outside, might come in hot, comes in a little bit too hot. All 
All right, the redneck bowler. Redneck engineer up for one more frame. Looks good. And it is good. Scott's going to take a minute take a minute to look up at the scores, contemplate life. Two more here will be a good finish. With his handicap well above 200. And that's a great ball. Uh, but let's see one more from Scott here in the 10th frame. Giving him a turkey. Well, excuse me, three leading up to the 10th, so six in a row. That's way outside. That's going in the gutter. And here is the final recap. Of the second game. All right, so Joe's going to start off the third game. He's been in the 250s both games. He has a shot at the beautiful 800 if he can carry. And he started off magnificent. Beautiful first ball from Bobby in the third game. Tony up to bowl. Joe, a.k.a. Me, striking the first frame. Bobby striking the first frame. And Clarence striking the first frame. Let's see if we can get one more. That's way outside, but it comes in nice and hot. All right, the star frame rests in Scotty's hands. And Scotty does in no. And he's got it. Star frame for the Bad Bad Bowlers, second time. All right, so JoJo started third game with the first two. Here we go for the third frame. Oh, nice ball. Beautiful carry. Line was perfect. We got Bobby Labani up in the third frame. That's way outside, but maybe it'll come in. And it does. Carries that 10 pin, no problem. Big C up in the third. Strike in the first. Uh, split. 8-1 in the second. Now that's a textbook ball. I make the best editor in town. Y'all motherfuckers ever. Ain't never said nothing. No, and I'm not joking. I mean, yeah, I make edible food. Scotty too hotty. Let's see the turkey giving the star frame for the bad bad bowlers. Too high in the pocket. Can't quite do it. That looks about right. It carries all ten. Bobby Labani. Big C with the strike in the fifth frame. Tony up, significantly further left from when he started, but that makes sense. The lanes are getting real washed. He got a strike in the first four, hoping for another one in the fifth. That's way outside. Comes in hot, S almost splits it like the Red Sea, but not quite. I kind of had faith in the Brooklyn, but it just does not work. Even a six ton. All right, I'm catching him late, but he buries another one, people. Bobby Labani up with a strike in the third, fourth, fifth, and sixth, hoping for one more in the seventh. Brooklyn's not going to cut it. All right, big C, let's see it. That looks about right. Oh, that pitch back, that pit. Pitch black really carried in hard. Last ball was a little bit high for Clarence. I thought that was a good ball, but that pitch black really carried. No problem with the spare, though. Okay, so JoJo currently on their first four. Take a look at him in the ninth frame. Oh, he got that out there, come back. Oh, he sliced through it, and that's okay. All right, the score entering the ninth frame. JoJo up in the ninth. Picking up that three line. And, oh, he missed it. Okay, so we're entering the 10th frame. We're up by a lot. You see JoJo fell off a little bit. I'm definitely off. Bobby's on his game. Um, Tony's definitely on his game. 279 if he pushes out. And Scotty Tuhati is balling too. All right. So, again, JoJo's hitting on 212. I would love to see him punch out. 
that would really make my day governor. Now he did go head to head with Derek and that match is not over yet. Oh, that's good. He ran that baby back like nobody's business. All right, so here we go with JoJo yet again in the 10th. Let's see if we can get the second one. Oh, that's clean. That's good. Bang the boogie, baby. All right, for JoJo's last ball in the 10th frame. Let's take a look at that infinite physics, which he is rocking. And that's right, he rocked the infinite physics all game long. Nice finish from Bobby Labani, giving him a 227 scratch, 233 with handicap. Big C up, if he strikes out, that's a 200 game. One of three. All right, let's do it, two for two. That's inside, will it hold? That urethane holds all day, baby. All three for Big C. Splits the Red C. All right, I'm going to get a, a shot of Tony's score after this 10th frame. But he's got a really nice game going. If he strikes out here, that's a, that's a very good game. That's way inside, but I think it'll hold. It does. That inside line works right now. The outside's all burnt up. The inside's fresh. All right, Tony, let's double it up. Double it up in the 10th frame. That inside line's gonna work again. Comes in just a little too hot. Leaving a 410. Tony said, make sure you get this one. So that indicates to me he thinks he's picking this up. Ah, it's a little too straight, not gonna work, but he got the one. The redneck engineer, the last bowler in league tonight. Hopefully gonna finish strong. That's an inside line. Doesn't have the Newtons to carry that 10 pin. The backspin from the redneck engineer. He engineers this one. Here's the final recap of all three games. 75 from JoJo. 572 from Bobby. 634 from Clarence. 680 from Antonio. And a 544 from Scotty Too High.